guys, welcome to the trim commonly. Um, the ship, I, do, I, I don't look about the information, but the only thing I do know was that the ship was built in 1817. Is that correct, ladies? Yeah. 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 Amazing place. Uh, what we thought we'd do tonight is the reason why we brought you here is for many reasons. You probably heard on the interview, well, you will hear on the interview, um, that it's on water. And what's water? A conductor. A conductor, yeah. So we thought, well, that would be a good thing. Uh, what we've got tonight as well, we've got some number of experiments. We've got a spirit board here, which we don't use as a conventional spirit board. Um, but I'll explain more about that later on. We've got a crystal ball here, which is the harbinger experiment. Um, and again, we'll explain a bit about that late, later on too. The other experiment we've got here as well tonight, which is down in the powder room. And it's called the... Kelpie experiment. Rather interesting one. Um, what we're going to do with regards to that <coughs> is we're going to choose some of the new people here tonight. <laughs> <laughs> the ones who haven't been with me before. And uh, you guys are going to get a raffle ticket. Okay. Uh, if, you, if you're lucky, you can win a bo bottle of wine. <laughs> you never know. Um, but uh, what we've also got here tonight as well, we've got the conduction rope experiment. So we're doing quite a fair few experiments tonight. But also in between that, we're doing ghost hunting vigils and we're doing the usual ghost hunting thing. But tonight, like I say, with all the experiments, we're giving it a bit of twist. Um, before we start anything, I'm going to have to introduce the ladies here from HMS Trim Comely. Ladies, if you want to come over here and just uh, give us the quick uh, briefing of the health and safety, please. Um, basic health and safety is obviously to stick together. Um, it is going to be very, very dark. There's obviously no lights on the mess deck and the hold. Um, there's lots of things that you can trip over, so do be careful. We do ask that you mind your head wherever you go, and we do ask that you go backwards on the ladder, so just like a ladder. They're exceptionally steep and they're not full steps, so just be very careful, okay? And obviously, any problems, any questions as you're wandering around, do just give us a shout. Thank you, ladies. Thank you. Uh, my own little bit of health and safety is I need to ensure that everyone's got a torch. Have you got a torch, guys? Yes. yes. Excellent. Yeah. We're all well briefed then. Um, the other thing as well is if for some reason that you get scared, please do not run. Okay? Please do not run because honestly you will smack your head. So do not <laughs> run. If you, yeah, it's true. true. And if you, you know, if any panic attacks or anything like that, please just keep still and we'll sort things out. If you, if you need me, I'm here, I will sort things out for you, okay? I'll, I'll look after you tonight. Um, and what I thought would be interesting, first of all, uh, let's introduce ourselves. Because if you introduce ourselves, any new people here tonight, it's going to be a better experience because we all know each other. We're all part of a team and tonight is all about energy at the end of the day. And if you get the energy right, then we're going to have a good night tonight. So my name's John Blackburn, uh, I'm a paranormal investigator stroke medium, I've been doing it for many years now. Uh, the Enigma experiment is fairly new and, um, and I hope you enjoy it tonight. So that, I'm, I'm just going to keep it short and then just go to Jim here. Hi, Jim Crudis, uh, I've been coming with John for <coughs> 10 years now or more. Uh, something mm -hmm. like that. Yeah. I want to say right, I've been coming with John for the last 10 years, same as Jim. And Pam, I've been with John for quite a few years. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Max and I'm John's manager, and I'm probably the one who's going to cause the trouble. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Judith and I've been coming with John for the last few years. I'm David and I've been uh, working with John for a lot, well, same amount of time as Jim. I'm Ros McCubbin and this is my second adventure with John. Ros, where's your pattern? I couldn't get out to get my eye patch either. Oh, well, never mind. <laughs> I'm Jason Cook. This is probably what my third event I've been to. Quite an experienced ghost hunter. Yeah, and plus you have your own haunted location as well. <laughs> my name's Julie. And I am brand new to all of this, so I've come here with an open mind this evening, and I'm sure I'll enjoy it. That's the way to do it, is to keep an open mind. That's brilliant, thank you. Uh, my name is Kevin, um, I'm 37 years old. Um, yeah, I'm a paranormal enthusiast. I've uh, known John since about September last year. Um, that's about it, really. I'm Julie, this is my second event with John. Very interesting, and I really enjoy coming with him. Thank you very much. 
My name is Brigitte Anadjiri and uh, this is my second event with John and I'm looking forward of tonight. The paranormal is my world. I just love it. Thank you. Okay, my name is uh, Kev. I'm also a paranormal investigator. This is our first time with the Enigma experiments and we're really looking forward to tonight. Do you want to say which, which call oh, company? We're from, oh. from Alia Sanctus. Yeah. I'm Chris, um, I've been investigating for the last four years with Kevin. Um, I'm also one of the co-founders of Abbey Sanctus. Our first time with John on an experiment, so we are looking forward to it and can't wait. I'm Linda, um, I've come away from Hereford, quite away. I'm really excited about coming here and I've been with John for about three years, I think. Yeah, it's been a while, hasn't it? About three years, yeah. That seems a lot longer. It does seem longer, but yeah, it's three years. Okay, guys, what we're going to do first of all, um, what I want to do, I want to take you through there into the main deck, because what I want to do is I want to generate as much energy as we can. Um, we're going to start on this top deck, and we're going to work down the decks. As I'm standing here now, the energy is pretty strong already, and I've been, I've been wandering around, as shows the film crew have as well, and you know what, you, the more deeper you go, the energy gets stronger and stronger and stronger. So I think it's going to be an interesting night tonight. So guys, are we ready? Yeah. Oh, yes. If you've got any bags or anything like that, you just want to leave a bit anything. more. Okay, and just in a minute, you probably, just relax for me, you probably start to feel that there's a bit of heat on your shoulders. Can you feel it? Yeah, it's going to get stronger. Yes, I can. I can. It's going to get hotter. Can you feel it? <laughs> Yeah, it's going to get hotter still. Just close your eyes for me. Just keep your eyes closed so you can't see what I'm doing now. Your fingers are starting to tingle a little bit. No. No? Because, uh, and tell me how you feel. Just, just tell me how you feel standing in that position now. Just keep your eyes. I'm feeling open. a bit shaky, actually. A bit shaky, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. This is your first time tonight. You're feeling shaky. Yeah. Okay. Is there anything yeah. else? Just be aware of the, the back of you now. Just be aware of the, the your, that area at the back of you now. I'm feeling like there's a lot of busy something mm -hmm. going around me quite busy. Yeah. It's like a look, lots of activity. Yeah. It's the best word I've come up with. It you feel all tingly. Um, yes. If I can see, it feels like there's a massive amount of energy going around me, spinning around me. Yeah, that's good. Are you okay a second? Just keep your eyes closed a second. Mm -hmm. I just want to yeah, yeah, it's, so, I'm, I'm completely okay? fine about it. Okay. Yeah, it's not, and it's settling down a little bit. I just want to talk to the person behind you now, but I'm not going to say out loud. I'm just going to say it in my head so we can see if we can get some communication now and keep your eyes closed so you don't know what I'm doing. I'm not influencing you now. Yeah. Yeah, I'm not influencing you. Strong. Yeah. I feel like there's lots of light going on mm -hmm. around me. And again, that thing's starting again. Mm -hmm. Are you okay with this? Oh, I'm absolutely fine. Yes, if I'm not, I'll say. It's kind of. Um, I'm aware of it. Mm -hmm. It doesn't disturb me or bother me. It's just um, still the same. Mm -hmm. Let's just, let's just wait a little bit longer. Let's do that. Just keep that energy with you, okay? Let's just see if you can keep that energy with you. Let's see if you can see. I just, have you ever, I've got something in my mind now. Sorry. Sorry. I've got something in my mind now and I just, 
Uh, tell, tell me if I'm right or wrong. Just tell me if I'm right or wrong. Yeah. I don't, it doesn't matter if I'm, if I'm wrong, okay. okay? At the moment, what I can see with you now, and I can think, I can see like an image which I hopefully is in your mind, and it's like a figure of a man, and he's got like, you can't see what he actually looks like, but it's like a, a dark figure, and what I see is like, he's is got like a that very red glow, you know what I mean? Can't see any red glow. You can't see any red, uh, not a red glow, sorry, like a, a white glow. But can you, can you can you see anybody in your mind? Do you know I can't? I doesn't be matter. With you. Yeah, I doesn't I matter. I can't see anybody. I can just feel. Yeah, I, I was hoping you'd see that. That's no. fine. Okay, guys, what we're we gonna do? Thank you very much for that. I just thought, I'd, you know, <laughs> pick on you, Dave. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So what we're we gonna do? is that we're going to get down a level, okay? Uh, what we're going to do now is, is a kind of a mediumship walk around. And the reason why we do a mediumship walk around is because it's like a survey, okay? And what we're trying to find is which are the most active parts of the ship here tonight. And those active parts we're going to be working. Except for, well, uh, we're going to do a survey except for one room, which is a powder room, okay? Uh, and there's a reason for that because we've kind of set something up, so, so we'll, we'll avoid that area. So guys, let's go downstairs, let's build some energy, I need to build the energy up, there's not quite enough room I don't think, and I, I want to do it downstairs anyway, so should we go downstairs? Let's do this. Thank you. Sorry? Nice windows open or something like that. No, it's um, okay, what, what will, the, just wait for the girls, we've got uh, a lady with a sore leg, so she's coming down now, she's coming down the road. <coughs> Fortunately, the HMS, HMS, probably, that's a hard word to say, it is gone, has gone. <laughs> it took me a week to get to, used to say, in it, trink oh, yeah. <laughs> Um Now then, guys, what I want to do is to build some energy down here, because what, what we do is all about energy at the end of the day, and I thought, well, this is probably the best place, it feels the best place. We have to be careful of these and the beams. Um, we'll ask for the camera crew, maybe just to get back a bit, guys, if that's okay. Certainly can. Yeah. Um, just, just a small bit for me. Can everybody right. form a circle around me, please, well. if you will? Come on, Mara. Hey, boys. Hey, boys. Does it have to go by the way? Yeah, what, what, we, what we want um, is ju just to explain to you guys watching that is what we want to do is we're going to put the men in between the ladies. The reason being is um, there, there is an experiment which we do which is called the uh, Mercurius experiment. And the Mercurius experiment is that ladies' energy is stronger than men. So if we have two men together, it kind of puts a block in the energy that we're trying to build. Yeah. So, okay. are you okay there, Ross? I am, I'm fine. So, Thank you. rather than holding hands first of all, what I want you to do, okay, if I can, if I can just control your hands a second, and just to let you know what I'm doing, I'm turning your hand up, okay? And I'm going to take your hand and I'm going to turn it pointing down and I'm going to take my hand away and leave half an inch in between. And what we're going to do, we're going to do alternate hands. So the, uh, your next hand is pointing down and yours, Jason, is pointing up. So it's alternate hands and I want you to leave half an inch in between. Okay, guys? Alternate hands, so it's your way cap, and it's half an inch in between. Okay. I can as well. Alternate hands, that's it. Brilliant. Okay? What we're going to do now, guys, what we want you to do is, is I want you to just uh, imagine, above my head now, there's a crystalline ball of energy. Just imagine this crystalline ball of energy. And just imagine it slowly spinning round above my head now. What I want you to do is imagine an umbilical cord of energy that's coming from the ball of energy above my head and you're taking it to the middle of your forehead. And this is a chakra point called your third eye. This is where you get your psychic ability from, your intuition from. And I just imagine that you're taking this pure white crystalline energy down into your body, right down into the base of your stomach. And just hold it there at the base of your stomach for me. Just imagine this energy is going deep down into your body through all the vital organs. 
right to the base of your stomach. And just imagine now, try to imagine that you're taking this energy in, down into your body, like I said, and then you're taking it up slowly, up towards your shoulders. Imagine this white crystalline energy going up towards your shoulders now. And as it gets towards your shoulders, imagine you're sending this white crystalline energy down your right arm to the person next to you. And the person next to you is going to take the energy up their left arm to the person next to them. And so on, and so on, and so on, until we've got a complete circle of energy going round faster and faster and faster. Just imagine that for me. Faster and faster and faster. And by now, you can probably feel that one hand is hot and one hand is cold. Can you feel that? Can anybody feel that? Yes. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. We're just keeping that energy going. Keep that energy going. And it's getting nice and strong in the middle now. The energy is starting to get stronger and stronger. What I want you to do is gently take the person by the hand. And just gently take the hand down by your side, still holding the person's hand. And work as a team, still trying to take that energy round faster and faster. We don't want any blockages in the circle. Really concentrate, just use your mind and just you send this energy round from person to person as we start to build this energy. Spirit relies on energy and that's what we're doing now. We're building this energy so spirit can use it. And what I want you to do now, guys, is I don't want anybody, okay, I'm not talking to anybody now, we're just talking to spirit now, okay, so I'm not talking to you on the outside of the circle, we have to come forward, open the door, lower the temperature, bring yourself through, bring yourself forward now, work with me now, use this circle as a form of communication, Use this circle as a form of communication. Use this form of communication I'm giving to you now. If you're going to work with me, I want you to bring a hand into the middle of the circle for me. Bring a hand to me. Bring it forwards to me. I'm not talking to anybody in the circle. You okay, Vegeta? Yeah. You okay, mate? Mind your head. Yeah. Bring a hand forward to me now. Bring it forward to me. Forward to me. Work with me now. Bring it forwards to me. Forwards to me now. Come on. Forwards to me now. Bring them forwards to me. Work with me now. Come forwards. Did you hear that, guys? Is that a sign there? We've just had very clear knocking. <laughs> Come forwards. Come forwards. Come forwards. Come forwards. Come on now. Touch my hand. Touch my hand, bring it to me. Bring it to me. Take it away from me now. Take it away from me now. Take it away from me now. Take it down. Take it down. Take it down. Take it down. Come on, take it down. Take it down. Okay, guys. How does everybody feel at the moment? Dizzy. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. It's powerful. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, it's a lot of en energy Lots tonight, energy isn't it? Mm. You know, the, the other thing, what I'm getting here at the moment is that there's a lot of men running around. You know, like upstairs, I was saying before, that there's like a bit of a panic going on. Mm. Um, I don't know whether it's a drill or what, but there's a bit of a panic going on. Um, over that direction, that direction. I feel that we need to go that direction, on that side. Um, what I want to do, if it's okay, I want to go over there, okay, to this side. Can I just go this way, guys? You can put your hands down now. Let's just, uh, 
Watch it, John. There's a table right in front of you, mate. Do you want on it? Yeah, I can hear. Yeah, was... Do you hear that knocking? No, there was noise. There was people talking and all sorts. Three, no, three, over that way. three very distinct knocks there. Yeah. I'm going yeah. to leave this camera here, mate. Do so. Yeah. Steve, yeah. man that, I'm going to leave EP, mate. Right. Okay. Please mind your head as you walk in there. <coughs> okay guys, I'm going to turn this torch off because white light just kills what we're trying to do really. So I'm going to turn this torch off a second. Okay. Um, how did you feel when you walked in this room? Heavy. Dizzy. Yeah. I know they uh, couldn't strong. walk through the door. Heavy. Heavy. Yeah. Dizzy. Headache. Shaking. I felt like somebody was following us, eh? Yeah. From when we got to where we were at the beginning, and then we stopped, isn't it? There was somebody definitely following us, and I can still feel it now. It's strong, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. Who's that talking to? It? Which one did you say? Yeah, watched Oh, that? Sorry, was that Chris then? It was Kev. Kev. Okay, Kev. Um, yeah, I'm pleased you said that because the you know, the energy in here is really, really strong. And the, as you can see, there's a, a dinner ta table out. I don't know if it's in the right place or not, but there's a man of command in this room. There's a man of, like, it is, it's pretty pretty powerful, okay? And the thing is about this man, I think he's gonna be interacting with us tonight. I do feel he's got, he's got a, some, some, something to, to show us hopefully tonight. Um, Feels very cold. Oh. I'm roasting. You're roasting? Yeah. In front of my face feels like it's really, really warm, as if somebody's got a game. It's so very cold. Yeah. I have a I'm sick feeling. A <laughs> sick feeling, yeah. Okay. Do me, do me a favour, Vegeta, can you sort of just start to rotate yeah. your hand around your tummy like that and I'll, and I'll get rid of it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Um. Do you want earphones on? That was my head on the roof to me. Was it? <laughs> 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 Alright, good point. <laughs> Sorry guys. It's a bit of quiet a sec guys, sorry if you don't mind. You know, in a, in a ship like this, I think there's been a fair few deaths, really. And there's a young boy, there's a young boy, is it, he must be all of uh, 12 or something, I think. Um, Yeah. Like that. Does this sound like a radio? It sounded like a radio. Yeah. Okay. Um, the, the thing that got them was that this, this young boy, okay, he was about, I don't know, 12, 12 years old or something like that. He was only a young boy. And is that the deck above there? Yeah, well, 
I, f I feel that, that that's where he, he met his death, this young boy. And do you know what I felt? I feel like he fell from, you know, a height. So I can, I can only suggest it's probably, you know, something to do with sales or whatever he was doing up there, but he fell from a great height. Um, okay, should, should we move on, guys? Let's move on. That looks beautiful. Okay, let's go this way, guys. It feels strong, doesn't it? Yeah, very, very, very heavy and very strong. Good God. They feel difficult. Everyone have difficult energy, but... You know, I think the fact that, again, it's, it's on water. This is, this is about the production side of things. And I do feel it's paid, paying dividends, really. Well, we've basically got a, a, a copper vessel sat in water, haven't we? That's what we've got. Copper based vessel in water. Yeah. I feel as if it would be as if we would be under the sea with the ship. Okay, we're going down, guys. So uh, just watch these steps as you're going down, please. Yes. Just uh, maybe if you, want, if you want to stand there. Yeah. yeah. Do you want to just make a, a bit of a line along here, guys? Right. I have got a headache, but not because I've hit my head. Like. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 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 Yeah, yeah, it smells really, like a rugby club, yeah, doesn't it? Yeah, I can smell it. <laughs> <laughs> it does. Yeah. Good description. Yeah. Yeah. Sort of keep that side. Okay, there, Jim. Well, you want to just stay on that side, guys, and just yeah. keep us along the path, man? Quite good, don't you? Supposedly good. Yeah. Well, I could live on that ship, to be honest. You could live on it. <laughs> you could live on it. I could. <laughs> <laughs> it would be very, very comfortable. <laughs> As if you would walk in old times, but yeah. time a different time, you know, you know a different... What would with the time machine, you know, you just go back in time. <laughs> yeah. <coughs> There's a lot of activity here. I just can feel it. Oh, you alright, Kevin? Kevin's getting agitated, I can see it. No, I'm just... I don't, yeah, I'm just I just got a headache, mate. Didn't have the crack his head. Yeah, no, no, no. It's slightly different, but yeah, didn't have. Nah. Straight in the beam. <laughs> Nearly knocked the beam down. <laughs> okay, can you just stay that side for us, guys? Okay. Okay, guys. Can I feel your soul to stay this side a sec? Okay. Yeah, you might want to go down there a bit, guys. Just squeeze up a little bit. This is cozy. Hey, Steve, can you just stand there for a minute? If you don't mind. Yeah, sure. You all okay? Okay, guys, if you all, if you all settled and you're all okay, we're all safe. Can you turn your lights off, please? Yeah. Yeah. Can you turn your lights off? Oh, they're coming down still, sorry. Are you staying there? Confess, I have been here before just just to check it out, but I'm getting the same thing again. And it's quite strong with me, really. I'm getting a prostitute, okay. And 
I think where's Max? What I was going to say is, <laughs> when we were doing last time, do you I remember? Prostitutes. No, do you remember? Yes. <laughs> do you remember? Okay. Um, <laughs> okay. Um, right. Okay. Come back. And you know what? This. Her energy's still here. For whatever reason, her energy's still here. But she did, I don't feel like she met her demise here. But it's still here. It's been drawn back here. Does that make sense? Mm -hmm. um, I don't know. If, I mean, you've probably wasted time in saying it in a minute. But I'm getting the name of Munro like a Munro name to this lady. So it's a surname of Munro. I'm just, I'm just telling you what I'm getting now. Um, is there, there was some kind of a disease on ship at some point? Because a man's shown me his face now. And he's got um, skin top problems. Yeah, it's like that type of. I don't, I don't even know what they look like. It's, you know, it's, it's, it is like scabby. Scabies. And this, this man particularly who's shown his face is, is, is dark eyes, really, really dark eyes. And I do feel that this is where one of the places that he's staying. I feel people, I'm, I don't know, I mean, just lay, ladies at the top, you know, who work here, if you just just say if you don't know or, you know, whatever, it doesn't matter, but I feel that this person I'm talking about now, the woman with dark eyes, the woman with skin problems, I do feel, that, I, I don't feel he shows himself like that, but I feel people have seen shadows. No? Okay, that's fine. That's the way he shows himself in like a shadow form, if you know what I mean? That's the way I feel like you'd, you'd, you'd see him if you was gonna see him. There's whispering down there. Yeah, yeah. Oh, that's... we could hear it behind us. I'll tell you something. what we'll do then. Yeah. Let's, let's just keep the deck quiet, guys. People see movement in here. Oh. It's movement at the end. Yeah, down there. Mm -hmm. Jason saw it as well. Yeah. Okay, guys, just just for five minutes, let's just keep deck quiet so we can hear the voices. It's like whispering. Just deck quiet, guys. See that? What did you? Someone move him, yeah. 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 You can see it on the camera. Yeah. Can you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Well, a figure just moved yeah. from there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. It's like going round. Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah, it's like it's it's turning yeah. round on yeah, the spot. Yeah, it is on the spot there at the bottom of the wall. Yeah. Is 
that not one of our shadow lighters? Oh, no. Kevin, okay, can you just stand to one side of it? Still there? Yeah. I definitely thought something went walk from left to right there. Yeah. It's interesting that that's happened when it's said about the shadows. Well, when you mm. were speaking, it's John. Not, it's yeah. it took me that it's up to the, it's it, high up. Yeah, it yeah. W it was down bottom and then it's gone up, but it, it was going from left to right because I was looking while you were speaking. Did anybody down here see that, guys? Uh, no, it's down now. I have seen it's right down. Right, but there were so many people down there, I didn't know if it's them. Can you see that too, guys? Well. Can you see it? What, can you see it? Yeah. There. Yeah. Yep. We all stand to one side a sec, just let, let, let the people at the back here see. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Wow, I'm just blocked this car. No, it were down there, wow. just now. Yeah. Oh, wow, there's orbs down there. Is there? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Bouncing all over the place. Yeah, there's loads of orbs. Activity's phenomenal down that end, uh, in there. Someone was trying to, they're trying to, are you? Can you see that post? Yeah, there's yeah. a light on it. I'm getting it on the yeah. camera. There, there's sort of like yep. some behind Yeah, don't, it. I'm getting it. And then it goes white. Yeah. It does. Yeah. And you keep seeing two white spots. Yeah. It's as if someone's got two LED lights. Yeah. 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 I just saw that move then. Is it still still moving? Yeah. Yeah, you can see it with your eyes. But is there, is there, like I said, there's lights Whoa. in this room, is there nothing no, there's there's it, moving? No, there's lights flying around. Has so, anyone got a torch on? No. 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 Nobody knows. The only light on is your camera. Ooh. Yeah. Right, okay. There is, there is I don't good, think there, there could be lights from outside, I don't know. I don't think so. I could feel it when we were talking, that's why I was staring now. Yeah, you could be whispering. We could hear it before we saw anything. Yeah, yeah we could hear it, all of us. Whispering. Michael? Where are you? I'm here. Yeah, I know there's something up here, man. Alright, I'll just... Uh, Put a light on for a minute and then I'll just stand out the way while everyone comes. I'll just stand there like that, yeah? Whoa, it's cold here. Yeah, it's here. Whoa, it's, it's, it's freezing. Yeah, it, feels it is different. This is freezing. Wow. This is where it was well, walking yeah. past. Yes. And then spinning round where Bridgeton is. It seemed to be more spot. that side oh, though when I, I, I Yeah, it was that side. I get drawn to that that place. Place. That That's side. why I go here. Yes, it was. Yeah. 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 Okay, guys. It's freezing cold. The, the energy in here now is really, really strong, isn't it? Are you okay with this light, John? Yeah, you're fine, mate. Okay. Okay, did you all see that, guys? No, what was it? Did you not? A, sh a shadow, was it? Oh, yeah, you saw that, yeah. Yeah? Okay. Um, yeah, Steve, can you just turn the light off? Isn't Certainly. Yeah, I can turn it off now, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. yeah. It's just to light the stairs. Okay, guys. Can we all just keep quiet just for a sec? Let's just keep quiet just for one sec for me, please. Okay, I'm talking to you now. Can you communicate with us, please? Can you start to work with us now? Can you use this collective energy? That we've got here. Yeah, it's really yeah, yeah, yeah. What did you hear, guys? It sounded like people talking. Yeah. Oh. Yeah.
Let's keep quiet again, guys. Let's see if we can hear it again for the cameras. Yeah. Guys, let's keep quiet a sec. Can you hear that? I can yeah. hear it. Can you hear that down there, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Have you got that, Mike? Mike? Hello. Have you got that down down there to get the sound down there? I've got this uh, recorder in my hand now, so... Fantastic. Should we just try try again? Can, can you... Have, have some quiet, guys. Just deadly quiet, please. I'll take a recorder down. Okay. Deadly quiet, guys, please. Let me ask you to come forward, please. Come forward and work with us. And just give us some communication so we can work with you tonight. Is that, is that Steve talking down? Is that I hear that as well, yeah. Whispering. Oh, he is. Talk to us, please. Let me hear your voice. Use the energy. There's something coming down this way now. Right at the bottom end, there's something rushing this way, Steve. I feel there's something rushing your way now, mate. Uh, sorry, not Steve, Michael. Something coming your way, Michael. Yeah. He, he isn't happy. He's not happy. He doesn't want you down here, Michael. Come on, can you do it stronger, please? If you don't want us here now, just do something stronger. We respect your views of us leaving here now, but just communicate with us. Do something stronger for me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is why I'm. I get orbs before anything happens. You know? Yeah. I just don't say anything. Yeah, Mike will tell you that it happens all the time, and then we hear something, and then yeah. it's like a, a sequence. Yeah. Yeah, yeah definitely. <clears throat> Do you know there's a dog on board as well? You wouldn't believe a dog would be on board ship, would you? But there's a dog here as well. The dog and the man that connected the boat, the, it's his dog. And he's not happy. <laughs> I, I can hear it, yeah. So happy, yeah. This is why I always look.
<laughs> La ladies, you know, who, who work here, can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. What? <clears throat> we, 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 we are at the bottom now, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, there was an orb as well that flew past. Just one. It wasn't dust. Yeah? Yeah, it feels like it's rolling. Yeah, like headache, yeah. yeah. It's like altitude sickness. Yeah, that's yeah. It. That's exactly the feeling. It is. Um, did you hear that? Yes. Yes. Yes, that was very loud. Was it? Uh, wow. Yeah. 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 Um, tell you what we're going to do, guys. I need to stand over there, actually. Um, can we get everybody up here a little bit? Follow you up. I don't know okay. whether anybody... I'll tell you what, we'll do it anyway. Guys, can everybody come this way a bit? I don't know if you're going to see this or not, but I just need to try something. Um, Judith, can I just borrow you a sec? Is that okay? Can I just bring you over here? Um, it's okay. If you don't mind, can you just put your hand on the shoulder? Can you see, yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Uh, I don't know if anybody else can see. Um, Vegeta, can you do me a favour? Yes. Can you come this side for me? Yes. Just, just watch your head. Of course, I'm coming. On your head there. Yes. Just put your hands on your shoulders. Yes. Of course. Yeah. Okay. I just need a bit of quiet down there, guys. Okay. <coughs> just need a bit of quiet down there, guys. If you can all come up a few steps so it's, so you can see. I just feel right now that I need to, may, maybe somebody can sort of sit on the stair there or something. Yeah, so we can let other pe people up. I'll sit on the step as well. I'm going to try something, okay. And I, and I feel Ooh. that I need to be here to do it and this is this is why I'm doing it now. So if you can sort of make a bit of room there so other people can get up there. Because we, we need people to see, maybe somebody can crouch down or something. Yeah. There's some amazing orbs. They're just beautiful, yeah. They're not dust, definitely beautiful. I'm sorry. Okay, we stop. Okay, guys. Just, I just need, I need your attention a sec, I just need to co concentrate and stuff. So if you just sort of come, come up here a little bit, that's it. Um, one, of the, one of the things that we was going to do experiment-wise was like... Um, having an experiment, wasn't it? And um, basically it's, it's like a transfiguration thing. I was going to use a table for it, but I feel here now is the right place and it just feels so strong at the moment. So. What I'm going to do is I'm going to just put this red torch on my face and I don't want it too bright and I'm not sure if the cameras are going to pick this up or not but let's just see what you guys can see. Now I just need to go into myself a little bit, I just need to, to just concentrate. And what I want you to do, to do guys, just just tell the cameras what you can see, okay, because I, don't I don't think the cameras will pick it up. Just, just, just tell them what you can see. Equally so, Vegeta. J Judy, if you can do the same thing. Yeah.
Yeah, your face around your mouth is like it's jowled. Drooped. It's yeah. all drooped. Can you see my camera? Yeah, it's You see around his mouth? Yeah. It, it's all drooping yeah. and getting like enlarged around there. Yeah, that's doing something. Did that work? It did. Yes. It did. Yeah. Okay. Did you get it on camera, Steve? I did. Round your mouth. Yeah. But one of your eyes looks a bit funny now you've opened them. Yeah, the one on the right. Yes. Side. Yeah, it looks a bit strange. Yeah. Don't know why you think your eyes look different. Okay. Just felt I had to do it there then. It felt right. The energy felt right. Um, okay, guys. Time now is... I'm just aware of time because uh, I just need to set a few things up. So... It is now 10 o'clock. Uh, we, we have got to be off the ship for half past two. So we're going to give, give us a quick 20 minute break and then we're going to get into some real stuff. Okay, does that sound good? That sounds good. great. Downstairs, it was good, wasn't it? Very good. Okay. What I thought we'd do is just a little bit of fun, something different, really. What I've got is I've chose you guys, I've given you all a ticket each year, and we've got the raffle tickets here. Now, I did this for somebody once and they thought I was going to win a, a bottle of wine. No, it's not a bottle of wine. Okay. But I'll tell you what it is in a minute. So, what we want is a uh, glamorous assistant here, please, if you're all right. If you can just pick out one of the raffle tickets. Yes. You can read it out, Vegeta. Yes, I will. <laughs> 522. Bingo. 522. Excellent, Linda. So, I'll just uh, hold on to that second. <laughs> you look happy. <laughs> That's the reaction we need. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No way you're going back. Five two five. 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 Five two Who's got five two four? No, 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 have you got a ticket? Yeah? Can you swap over with Kev? That's yeah. okay. No, sorry, I swapped seats. Swap seat. Swap seat. <laughs> yeah. There you go. Now, what I've got, okay, I've got three envelopes in, in here. So obviously we've only got three, well, we've got six altogether, so we need to eliminate down to three. So, would you rather Open the envelope and take on the challenge. Or would you rather pass it on to the person opposite you? Ow. <laughs> take the challenge. <laughs> well done. Twist. <laughs> okay. Linda, would you rather take on the challenge yourself or pass it opposite? You're not going to do it. Well done. <laughs> Jason. <laughs> Jason, would you rather take, take it on yourself or pass it to the person opposite? Pass it over. Jason! Well, she's got to end. Okay. What do I want you to do first of all? I'll show you how I'll do it if you don't. <laughs> <laughs> what a job! 
Oh, oh, right. Right. Here we go. So what I've got, I've got three different experiments here. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna ask you if you can take one envelope. Lynn, take one envelope. I'll take your envelope. Thank you. And what you need to do is to open the envelope and just read what's inside it for me. <laughs> Someone's going to say, oh, it's not him. <laughs> <coughs> I've got blind man's buff. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I've got Sorry, the mate. Zena experiment. The Zena experiment, okay. Oh. That's not so bad. Sorry. We'll do that yeah. later on. I don't know what this means, but Kelpie experiment. <laughs> <laughs> All right, <yeah>. so... <laughs> the Kelpie experiment. <laughs> now, let's tell you what we're going to do next. I've got a big thing coming up, okay? So what I'm going to do is I'm going to walk over here, and what we've got, just to help you guys, you can just stand to the side a little bit, and just mind your head, oh, there we go. What we've got, we've got, we've set up a little bit of a tannoy system here, okay? And uh, I'm going to plug my phone in. I'll plug it in the top there, and I'm going to bring manager, my manager, Matt team. Don't even oh, bother. Great. <laughs> 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 I'll turn, better turn it on first, isn't it? And um, we're going to put it in on auxiliary. There we go. And I'm going to bring up Maxine now. I don't do technology, eh? Oh, I know. <laughs> um, okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Just looking for the we found that, didn't we? She's got to run out. Is that working? Yeah, we're working. So if you can answer that for me. Yeah. Okay. So what we're going to do is um, I'm going to leave this here, okay? And you guys will be able to hear on the Tannoy system. Um, do you want to come with us? So, can I get it? Has it gone down? Cheers, Pam. We're going to start doing the Calvary experiment. And this is quite an interesting one tonight. Just mind the stairs, ladies. Alright, Steve. Yeah, he's on it. Okay, we're going down, we're going to start the experiments. They're here. in the mirror. Okay. Can you see those two dolls? I can indeed, yes. <clears throat> that's Sweet Pea and that's Florence Nightmare. Oh. Basically what they are, they're, they're both morning dolls. And what morning dolls are is in the Victorian era um, there was a lot of mortality rate, you know, with children. Yes, yeah. And uh, what they did is that they put a doll in the coffin with the child. Okay. And these and re replicas, no. They're, they're, they're obviously not originals. Yeah. Um, now what we're going to do upstairs, we're going to try and communicate with a friend of mine called, well, a spirit friend, okay? Uh -huh. And we're going to ask him to move one of those dolls. Okay. Are you okay with that? I'm fine with that. Right. I've got to your ladies. Tell me about it. <laughs> um, so what we're going to do as well, just to see if something happens, we're going to put a camera in here as well, would you? Yeah. So we're going to set that camera up now. And um I'm gonna lock it in with her. I'm gonna leave a recorder in with her as well. Oh, just really in case we get some <coughs> EVP. So it's just gonna be here just next to you, my mate. I'm Whilst gonna... we've got a recorder in, in there as well, can you do me a favour, Ju Julie? Julie, 
if you see anything move, can you sh can you shout out for me? Because Maxine's just on the other side of that wall. Okay. Okay. Um, so if you can tell us what's going on at all times. The other thing as well is you probably notice in this room it's all copper. Okay. So the reason for the copper is it's because it's a powder room. This is where they kept kept all the gunpowder. Powder. It didn't allow anything to spark. Yeah. But for us, it's all about conduction. I understand. Yeah? Yes. Okay, we all set there. Uh, camera's on rolling. We've got the shoulder of the lady. We have the two dolls in... <coughs> in shot. In, in shot. Yeah. And we've got the voice recorder. Yes, and we have an EVP. If you, if you do panic, try and grab this if you knock it over at the same time because <laughs> it's quite close to you. Right. I'll set this off recording now. Mm -hmm. I'll leave you to do your magic, Jack. Will we? Thank you. That's, uh, are we on? Yeah. Excellent. Okay. Yeah, we are. are you okay with this? Just, just to this well, side of you here. Yeah, I'm cool. Yeah. Right, brilliant. I'm going. Don't worry, we'll be right in if you hit it if it starts, don't worry. If what starts? If anything moves or anything like that and you freak, we'll be right in with you. Don't mm. worry. Yeah. Okay. So. Off we go. Good luck, my love. What was if I swear? It doesn't matter. I'll okay.
you okay in there? I'm fine, thank you. Fine. Everything's fine. You feeling okay? No, you don't feel strange or. I'm getting waves of feelings, and it's sort of coming and it's going. Um, it's more of a feeling. Right. She's getting. I'm not getting the visual, but I'm getting the feeling of something coming and going. Okay. There's actually no visuals, but she's getting a feeling like you know, like waves of coming and going. So she's getting a strange sort of coming and going it, it, feeling as such. But nothing's physically moved yet. Just, just think I'm feeling so I've got my glove. Just think I'm feeling Hello Johnny, okay mate? Right, there's nothing physically moving visually, but she feels like sort of waves of energy coming and going. So she's getting feelings but no physical movement in the room yet as so. such. One second. Which direction do you feel like these waves are coming from as such? It's coming from the mirror. From the mirror? Yeah. <laughs> It'll hurt this one. John, the feelings are coming from the mirror, my friend. Perfect, okay, John. I'll just let know. Right, he's just going to try one more time, uh, see if we get anything, and then I think you'll, you'll be open in there. Okay. Alright, mate. Alright, she's ready to go. Right, she's ready to go. To me, please. Come on, to me. Bring it to me. Bring it to me, please, David. David, come forward. David, we just want your help, please, if that's okay. Bring yourself forward. We just want you to work with us, and we want you to just um, help us. We've got Maxine downstairs, and we just want you a little bit of help. With Maxine downstairs, or just with an experiment, can you bring yourself forward? Just an ever so light touch, guys. Bring yourself forward, please. Bring yourself forward. David, we're asking for David to come forward, please. Just might take a little bit to get going. Steve, it won't shut, hopefully not, not too long. David, please bring yourself forward, please. Bring yourself forward, come and join us now. Come join us and work with us. We just want you to do a little experiment with us and just uh, just try to move something from me if you can. David, come forward. David, come forward. David, open the door, lower the temperature and bring yourself through, please. Thank you. Okay, David, thank you. Is da David, is that you? Come towards me if it is. Come towards me, David, towards me, David, if it is. Bring, bring it towards me if it's you, David. Thank you very much, David, thank you. Can you take it into the middle of the table, please? Here. Take it into the middle of the table, please, David. David, take the planchette in the middle of the, of the board, then. The board, sorry. Take it to the middle of the board. David, take it away from me, please. Take it away from me, please, so I can talk to you. That's it, thank you. Okay, can, D David, can you do me a favour? Can you bring the planchette towards me for yes? Bring it towards me for yes, towards my fingers, which are on the edge of the board. Bring it towards me for yes, please. David, bring the planchette towards, it, towards me for yes. Bring yourself towards me for yes. Thank you. And now take it away from me for no. Thank you. David, can you do me a favour? We're on this ship, HMS Twin Comely, and down in the floors below, we have got what's called a powder room where they used to keep all the gun gunpowder. It's actually lined in copper, okay? In there, we've got two dolls that you're familiar with. David. Are you able to move one of those two dolls? Say yes if you can. Come on, David. Say yes if you can. If you can move one of the dolls for me, or both, say yes if you can, please, David. I'm going to step in while the energy's going and take it from there. So would you like to come up? Oh, gosh. Right, 
Oh, dolls. Yeah. Right, one minute and I'll be in position. 